Well, welcome back. Ryan Dickinson has been in Shreveport for nearly two seasons now, so he's experienced quite a bit of success in a Mudbugs jersey. Jory Perry sits down with the defenseman in this week's Meet the Mudbugs. I'm joined here now by Ryan Dickinson. Ryan, you've been in the NHL for four seasons. This is your second year here in Shreveport. Quite simply, what has been your favorite memory so far as a Mudbug? Uh, last year, uh, game five versus our rival, the Lone Star Brahmas, uh, triple overtime. It was just a really fun, cool feeling for, for all the guys in the room to take down a rival and advance in playoffs. So I understand there's some NHL history in your family. Can you explain some of that to me? Yeah, so my uncle uh, played for the Toronto Maple Leafs. He actually knocked out Wayne Gretzky, believe it or not. And then my grandpa, he played for the Detroit Red Wings, the Montreal Canadiens, the New York Rangers, and the St. Louis Blues. Word on the ice is that you're one of the biggest chirpers on the team. Tell me, when did you really start to become vocal as a player? Growing up when I would play hockey and we would have our rivalry games and you play the same kids, you kind of kind of get into it with the kids on the other team and I was kind of good at it and I just kind of kept doing it and it keeps me engaged in the game. Ten questions for you, rapid fire, say the first thing that comes to your head. You ready? Yeah. Favorite social media platform? Instagram. Favorite movie? The other guys. Favorite song right now? Right now we have a walkout sound that we listen to. It's like a remix of Panda and some other song I don't really know the name of. And it's got like LeBron James's uh, NBA championship speech like throughout it. What is your dream vacation? Hawaii. Who inspires you? My parents. Favorite professional team? Detroit Red Wings. Funniest guy on the team? Dylan Peters. What is a talent that you wish you had? I wish I could play guitar. If you could only eat one food forever, what would you eat? Uh, Karen Muskets Jambalaya. Show me your go-to dance move. The old Nene. I kind of give it that one as a little cringy, but... Ryan, thank you so much for your time. Thank you very much. And Dickinson and the Mudbugs get back on the ice this Friday night when they play host to first place Lone Star Puck Drop set for 7-11.